All right, Christian, we're going to watch our freestyle here above the water. Uh, Christian, okay, so I got to tell you real quick, one of the things I really like, I love how high your elbow is here. And I like how low your hand is there. That looks fantastic. Head position also looks like the right height in the water. But what I'd like to do is see your eyes look down just a little bit better. You tend to have your eyes looking a little more forward. So just get that head down a little bit better. But where your, where your head is in the water is the right depth. As your hand starts to enter, you can kind of see that your elbow starts to enter before those fingertips. So get that head down just a little bit earlier. You exit the water here on the left side with a really good high elbow. But then you can see you start to straighten out almost too much. You want to keep that elbow bent just a little bit as your hand starts to enter. When you're en entering completely extended like this, you're not really getting any good pull on the water. You want to make sure you kind of drive your hand forward a little bit and then get that catch a little bit earlier. Okay, I do like this breathing a lot. I still think we can take our head from this position and lay it down a little bit better, but your eyes are perfect. You've got one goggle in the water, one goggle out of the water. That's fantastic. So, so good. I like how you keep that elbow nice and high still, even with the breath, that's good. We do want to make sure you keep getting that head down like this. Okay, your eyes are down right in the middle of your stroke, right before your hand enters. That's excellent, Christian. Can I see that kick out there? You're doing what we call a crossover kick, where sometimes your legs kind of cross your ankles a little bit. Just keep your legs steady up and down all the way through. All right, we want to work on not breathing that last stroke into the wall, right? The idea is really, ideally, if you were not breathing from your flags in and out of the wall, you'll be perfect. But at least get two strokes into the wall, two strokes off the wall without a breath. As we go into the turn, I love your feet. Your feet are about hip width apart, which is excellent. Very nice job there. Um, keep working at making sure that those hands are in this tight streamline. Streamline looks good. One, two dolphin kicks. And you can even see here that you're already lifted your head up a little bit, and I don't really see any flutter kick off that wall. So you're about half a body length past the flags, which is good. You could get almost two body lengths past the flag if you add in some flutter kicks, and then you keep your head in that streamline. You can see, again, you're already got that breath and your hands out of the water. So don't work on that first breath. Try to get at least two strokes without a breath off that wall. Straight arm recovery as you enter. Try to get that elbow bent just a little more, Christian, then you'll be great. Perfectly done. Well done, bud.